Just before 2 p.m. today, the motorcade carrying President Tsai Ing-wen arrived on the tarmac at the Philip Goldson International Airport. There, the President was greeted by CEO in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Ambassador Amale Mai, and Deputy Prime Minister Cordell Hyde. After a brief exchange of words, President Tsai was escorted to the China Airlines aircraft. The red carpet was flanked on both sides by BDF soldiers. As she made her way up the steps, the leader of the Republic of China, Taiwan, waved goodbye and entered the plane, concluding her second visit to Belize since taking office in 2016. The visit was part of a Central American tour to Guatemala and Belize, the only two countries in the region with whom the Republic of China-Taiwan has retained diplomatic ties. It comes on the heels of Honduras cutting relations with Taiwan in favor of establishing ties with China. During the three-day visit to Belize, of significant importance was a technical cooperation agreement signed between both countries. It is encouraging to see these projects taking shape in Belize. In addition, technical projects are essential to bettering the lives of our citizens. Therefore, I'm also delighted to bear witness to our foreign minister's signing of an agreement that was streamlined and strengthened our bilateral technical cooperation. I look forward to more cooperation in the many years to come. This agreement will serve to further establish cooperation programs in areas such as agriculture, forestry, technology, education, climate change, youth and women, health, tourism, and other areas of mutual interest. Likewise, it is a reflection of the many projects our two countries are presently engaged in as we continue to strengthen our bilateral relations. Belize and Taiwan share a long-standing friendship that spans almost 34 years. Taiwan is 57% larger than or a little more than twice the size of Belize, with a population of 23.3 million people. Like Belize, it is culturally diverse with indigenous peoples, as well as immigrants from across the world. Cooperation between both countries span areas of education, health, infrastructure, hurricane relief, and agriculture. During a special sitting of the House of Representatives, President Tsai reflected on this, her second visit to the Jewel. I have very fond memories of my last trip to Belize. I visited Taiwan Street, where our embassy stands. I also remember meeting aspiring young Belizean and was very happy to offer scholarship for their studies in Taiwan. I remember thinking these bright minds will eventually serve as bridges for our friendship in our shared future. I also remember visiting the Museum of Belize, seeing the drawings of slave ships and hearing dreadful stories of the slave trade. What our two countries share is the strength and courage to rise from our challenging past and make our present and future free, right, and prosperous. Dwayne Moody for News 5.